Good afternoon, Aaron here at Pacific Toyota and Lexus of Cairns, taking you through our virtual tour on our 2019 Dual Cab GXL Land Cruiser. Quickly before we get started, just a tour here of our yard up in Cairns. So stocking over 200 cars at any given time here, uh, between our yard here and our other yard as well up the other end of Mulgrave Road. Got our new car showroom across the road there our lexus showroom next door and then our parts and services is also tucked in behind there so nice and close up here um so let's get straight into it so obviously going to go throughout the car inside and out just showing any little marks and scratches on the car um you know any little imperfections as well and then also uh we'll go through any of the features that the car has as well so just to get you a nice um inside look rather than just uh photos there so we'll get started we'll start down the front here so obviously you've got your genuine bull bar there side rails side steps um all the way around the front of the car so you know it's very very clean um it's gonna obviously protect the car there as well uh got our headlight protectors there it's got a little little crack there and there so obviously that's been doing their job um bottom protector there along the top Headlight protectors there on the other side. Got our two spotties up the front there as well. And then also the bar is winch compatible too. You do need to get a different winch cradle there to go inside, but you can get one so that plate comes off. GME UHF um, aerial there. You've got the XRS Connect inside as well. But really, really nice there. Down the guards here, up on the bonnet. Really, really nice and clean all the way around. Up on the windscreen, no cracks or chips or anything like that as well. So really, really nice. Got your factory snorkel there um, as well on the right hand side here going into the airbox. So that's all there. Have a look down the guards, really, really nice and clean. Your tires there plenty of tread on the tyres and you've got your nice big alloy rims there as well make our way down the side of the truck no dings or dents or anything like that um, throughout the, the car so really really nice and clean got your genuine steel tray painted there on the back um, colour coded to the car so makes it look if not better Rim and tie there, plenty of tread there as well. we'll. Make our way around the back. You've got your spare up under the tray. We've got a tow bar there as well. Seven pin flat plug there. Really, really nice and clean. Rim and tire package there. And plenty of tread up in there as well. Really, really nice along the doors there. And then your guard there as well. And the rim and tire up the front here as well. I'll jump up on the roof and show you the condition up here. As you can see, really, really nice. Obviously no dings or scratches or dents or anything like that. Really, really nice. Alrighty. We'll uh, jump inside and make our way through the inside of the car. Let's jump over this side, get the sunlight out of the out of the camera. It's just probably even worse to be honest. Um, anyway, so you've got your nice clean door cars there, really really nice and clean in the back here. Um, little ashtray or coin train there as well. Auto windows, really really nice seats in here. Um, they've definitely been well looked after. Barely looks like anyone's been sitting on them to be. Completely honest. Really, really nice. There's your uh, tongue there. Um, so we keep them inside, obviously, just so that um, they don't get nicked there during the night time and that side of things. Um, we do see a couple of the, the tow balls and that go walk about. So we keep them in the cars. Um, really, really nice um, and clean up in the dash here. Obviously, you've got your... Um, auto windows, door and window locks there. Got three keys uh, and then two of your obviously your central locking keys there. Spotlight switch, idle up, 
when it's cold. Um, she can use that. I mean, I guess you don't have to use that a lot of the times, but it is there, um, you know, if you want to warm up the engine. You've got your DPS button there as well. But in here, really, really nice and clean, as you can see. The seats are in immaculate condition there. And the dash, you've got that nice dash man up the top there to stop the sun from cracking the dash or anything like that. Alrighty, I'll jump in, start it up for you. Um, so, no engine lights, anything like that. As you can see, 61,000 Ks. Um, handbrakes off there, I just put that down, then I just don't have the seatbelt on, so that's what that light is. I'll give it a little rev there for you as well. So you can see that. Got your cruise control down at the side here on the steering wheel. Obviously a little clock there, hazards there, full Bluetooth um, system there as well as radio and everything like that. You've got uh, all your aircon controls in there as well. And then this one here is um, your antenna. So if we have a look outside there, you can see the antenna going up and down there. So that's what that is traction control button there you've got your diff lock um, buttons here as well but you need to have the car in in four-wheel drive obviously to put those ones in uh, which brings me to this four-wheel drive stick there so you've got your low range your high two high four um, and your low four there obviously uh, manual five speed there with reverse down the bottom right got our GME XRS um, UHF there as well, so 80 channel UHF. So really, really nice there. 12 volt storage uh, outlet there, sorry. Got your cup holder and that side of thing in there. A little bit more storage here and here. Um, little cigarette lighter there as well. Glove box, plenty of space in there. Um, I'll go through the service books there as well in a second. Obviously your handbrake um, there and then got plenty of storage up in there as well so sorry the sunlight um, is a little bit tricky this time of the day but servicing wise everything's all been done well so all been service there 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 has missed the 50,000 and then it's just gone to the 60 so um, you know that's been been all done properly there at 57,000 k. So I only just had a service before we've um, acquired the car, um, which is good. Now I can just tell you it was a private owner um, from Charters Towers as well. So um, I just can't show the information out of the, the book there because the video will go on YouTube, but yeah, it is a private owner um, out of Charters. So, all right, I'll, uh, jump on out and I uh, will open up the bonnet and show you underneath. Alrighty. Really, really nice and clean up under here. Got our washer fluid there, our battery fuel filter up the back there. It's cooler on the top, our engine oil top up there, our dip zip back there, along with our brake fluid and clutch fluid, and then we've got our air box just here, and our cool overflow bottle there as well, so no funny noises, ticks, rattles, anything like that, really, really nice, clean car, and runs very, very well. Alrighty, that's going to conclude our virtual tour on our 2019 Dual Cab GXL, thanks for watching.